Hey guys, Amp here bringing you another Affinity Photo tutorial and in this tutorial we'll be going over the gradient map adjustment. So I'm going to come up and uh, come to gradient map adjustment and it's going to pop up with this uh, dialog box with a gradient map and it's going to start off with red, green, and blue. Now red is going to take all of the shadows and turn it red into a gradient of green which is going to represent all of your midtones and then that green is going to go into the blue and that blue is going to be the highlights. So as you can see here with all the white uh, waves it's going to take all the white waves and make it blue and as well as the sky. So we're gonna add a gradient map to it and this is a beach, so we don't really need a lot of green. And now all of the highlights are being put into blue, into uh, red, so there's no green involved. If you want to change the colors, which I definitely do, you can also reverse these, and that kind of makes it like the 3D kind of glasses effect. But I don't want these colors, so what can you do about the colors? So I can Let's say I wanted pink here. And let's say I wanted maybe like a light orange or cream right here. So it kind of has like the pink and orange sherbet kind of look. You can have it come over here and you can then drag the opacity down maybe 50 percent let's see 45 looks good so now the opacity of the gradient map has gone down enough where the background image is being shown through and it kinda gives that dusk sunset effect that she's kinda like looking off to a dusk sunset um, you can also play around with the blend mode um, darken might look good. Darken color looks okay. You might have to bring the opacity down a little more. It kind of blurs. Um, color burn. Lighten. It really depends on which colors you choose. Um, usually color is pretty good. I like color. I think I'm just going to stick with color. Um, and if you wanted to save this um, gradient map to use on other things, say you have a bunch of photos that you need to make look like it's dusk time, you can add a preset, name it pink sunset, and now you have a preset that you can always go back to, and it will be this. You can also add more colors, but um, usually two really works out for because you really just want to take the highlights and the shadows and not really play around with the midtones because the midtones will kind of leave the picture the way it is. So that is the gradient map in Affinity Photo. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more Affinity Photo and Affinity Designer tutorials. Thanks for watching.